What's up, y'all? It's Emil and it's Junior back here with Clever News. And Little Mix fans are convinced that Leanne Pinnock threw some major shade at Camila Cabello during a recent Instagram Live. Following the worldwide protesting in support of the Black Lives Matter movement, it seems celebrities are being exposed left and right for any previous racial slurs, tweets, and remarks that have surfaced on the internet. Many even recall as early as December when Camila Cabello was called out for sharing racist posts via her now deactivated Tumblr account from back when she was 15 years old. Users began sharing screenshots of Camila's account, which showed her repeatedly using the N-word and reposting lots of racist jokes and content. Camila quickly issued an apology about how deeply ashamed she was and that she was, quote, uneducated and ignorant in the past. In her apology, she added, Once I became aware of the history and the weight and the true meaning behind this horrible and hurtful language, I was deeply embarrassed I ever used it. I apologize then, and I apologize again now. She also revealed that she would never intentionally hurt anyone, to which her apology was met with little controversy, as it seems that many fans forgave her and moved on rather quickly as if nothing really happened. Musicians, actors, influencers, and more have been losing jobs, brand deals, and entire reputations amid the Black Lives Matter movement as a result of their past. But fast forward to earlier this week when Little Mix's Leanne Pinnock, who has been very outspoken about her own experiences with Black oppression, seemed to call out Camila for receiving barely any backlash following her controversy. During a recent Instagram Live that was recorded by some fans, Leanne spoke out on the fact that someone who didn't get any backlash following exposure of her past racist remarks hasn't been brought back up. Leanne made it a point not to specifically name who she was referring to, but not so subtly hinted that it was Camila she was referring to with this. And she didn't get no backlash from it. Like she, she still got to perform at the Grammys. Mm -hmm. Referring to performing at the Grammys, Camila did appear to perform her song First Man to her father during this year's award show, which is why many fans are catching on. After saying that she wasn't going to name names, Leanne then corrected herself by saying, well, I will eventually, but just not now. She also referred to this incident by saying, it's actually disgusting, it's so bad. And to have no sort of repercussions from that, I just thought, hmm, really? This all caused fans to automatically assume Leanne was talking about Camila, as many began defending Camila on Twitter. One user wrote, Lee mentioned no names and y'all assuming Camila if the shoot fits, eh? Another fan tweeted, Camila stays unbothered and she's actually changed and helped movements for the better of black lives. However, this didn't stop some fans from defending Leanne and her feelings towards the matter, considering no black person should ever be told how they should or shouldn't feel about the situation. One user wrote, the way Lee didn't even have to mention Camila's name for her stands to get mad. If the shoot fits. Another user said, don't invalidate Leanne's feelings. This is not a fan war and she has every right to be upset with Camila regardless. Fans are likely also seeing Camila's lack of backlash considering she's also had drama with her former bandmate Normani. Normani even spoke out about her feud with Camila and toxic fans attacking her back in the day during a Rolling Stone cover story back in February. She detailed what transpired during the time of the post, saying, quote, it was devastating that this came from a place that was supposed to be a safe haven and a sisterhood because I knew that if the tables were turned, I would defend each of them in a single heartbeat. Normani also recalled that it took days for her to acknowledge what I was dealing with online and then years for her to take responsibility for the offensive tweets that recently resurfaced. Whether or not it was her intention, this made me feel like I was second to the relationship that she had with her fans. With everything currently going on in the world and the continued acts of racism in this country, it's more important than ever for us to continue to learn Learn and grow as a society as there is still so much work to be done. With all that being said, we here at Clever also want to make sure we've made our stance clear. We stand against the injustices suffered by members of the black community and we stand with every black person who has tragically lost their lives due to the color of their skin and police brutality. If you're looking for more ways to educate yourself and get involved with the Black Lives Matter movement, we've linked resources down in the description below. And to see why celebs are facing backlash for calling for action amid the Black Lives Matter movement, click right over here for another Clever News video. And of course, let us know all your thoughts on what Leanne had to say down in the comment section below. I'll be reading. I'm your host, Emilinus Jr., and I'll see you soon right back here with Clever News. Bye, guys.